when I ponder and I look back upon my life, I seemingly find myself thinking that my life resembles a shattered mirror. A mirror that was once whole and contained just one story, one single story. And it had a beginning and it had an end, I guess. And it was pretty typical. But knowing that my mirror has been shattered, what I see now within every fragment of that shattered mirror are moments and memories of different chapters, different sentences, different paragraphs, different stories of me, of me and my journey. And my journey has been a long one, a crazy one, a silly one, a funny one, a sad one. It's been a thriller, it's been a horror flick, it's been dramatic, it's been fiction, it's been non-fiction, it's been a little bit of everything. But I have to say that being able to look at each fragment of those pieces of broken glass is a reminder of my journey. My journey. How I came to be and how I got to where I am. And even though those pieces are mixed up in a jumbled mess, because when a mirror is shattered, it's shattered. It doesn't matter because each and every single piece has a story to tell. And in no in particular order, because my journey was my journey, mine alone. And it happened to be many journeys. It wasn't just one single story. My story of me comes in series, not chapters. It comes in moments, not minutes. It comes in living and not life. And I wouldn't take any of those moments back because they have shaped me, formed me, and molded me and made me the human being that I am today. I am strong. I am capable. I know how to love from the depths of my heart. I'm learning how to forgive. <laughs> That's a fight. But I've forgiven a lot. And I'm learning how to right my wrongs, how to humble myself, how to live in the moment, not let life pass me by, by impatience or sour moods. I'm learning that every single second is an opportunity to make one more shattered piece of glass, a mirror, a reflection of me reflection of who I am and as broken as I may be I'm free because I broke the boundaries of the solidity of what once contained me I don't know if that makes sense to any of you I'm willing to bet it does I'm willing to bet don't ever stop being you. Don't ever stop loving you. Don't ever give up on you. Don't give up on the world. And know, just know, that your shattered mirror and those fragments are pieces of you. They belong to you. You earn them, you own them. The good, the bad, and the ugly, they're yours. And you can't have a very good story to tell anyway if you don't have the heights of happiness or the depths of despair you have to have that balance your yin and your yang your as above so below and it's okay to hurt it's okay to look back and be sad but most of all it's okay to embrace all of those moments because it's shaped you and formed you and prepared you for this moment, this moment right here, the one that we stand in, the times that we're in, it has made you the warrior and the fighter that you are today. 
And I praise God for that. So I can't imagine if I didn't have that preparation, living in these times, what would I do? How would I go about it? I couldn't. We were born warriors, but we were molded into the form and the shape and the capability of dealing with what, what is coming or what's at hand. Our purpose is great. Our hearts are big. And our worthiness is greater. And we're here for the fight. We are here for the fight. And nobody can convince me otherwise. Because every last broken piece and fragment of that glass told me so. I'm sure it tells you the same thing. It doesn't have to be easy. The road wouldn't promise to be easy. But it's a road. <laughs> it's a road. It's our road. It doesn't matter if we have the choice or not. What matters is what are we going to do with that? What are we going to do with those fragments? I feel like throwing some of them at some people, but maybe accidentally cutting them with it. But yeah, no, that's the human side. What I'm going to do with my fragments is cherish them, hold on to them, remember them, and remind myself that I can do this. I can do this. So can you. Love you guys.